Hi, my name is Mark. Welcome to Grace in Motion. If this is your first time here, then take about five minutes and watch the introductory video on our website, gimsimple.net, and it will give you some background information about Grace in Motion. We also have videos on our website that will walk you through our four core practices of pray, go, baptize, teach. This is our first video lesson, which leaves out those parts so that you can do them separately. And this one just jumps right into the lesson. So today's lesson is on John chapter two. We're calling it, Hey, Party Jesus. Because one of the very first things that Jesus does, the first miracle is changing water into wine. This is how he publicly revealed his glory, quote unquote, for the first time by serving alcohol at a party. So, hey, party Jesus. Um, we're actually going to get into another part of John 2, which is not so, hey, party Jesus, where he has a different reaction to things. But if you have a Bible, go ahead and turn to John chapter 2 in the New Testament or use an app like Bible Gateway and find John 2. Take some time to read it together in the group that you are in or by yourself and then discuss or reflect on what you notice and wonder about this section of scripture. What are the noticings, the observations that you make? And then what are the wonderings, the questions that you have about John chapter two? So go ahead and pause the video and take time to discuss or reflect on that now. So John 2 really has two different stories in it. The first one is the changing of water to wine at the wedding party. And so here is that passage on the screen. Take some time to just kind of review it again one more time to look through the pieces of that. You can pause the video as you need to. And then the second one is this time where Jesus seems to get upset um, about the money changers in the temple courts. And this is John chapter 2, verses 13 through 22. So take again to take time again to review that passage and see what it stirs up for you. So just some summary points on these two things from John 2. First of all, in the wedding at Cana, Jesus takes the stone jars that are used to hold water for ceremonial cleansing, and he fills them with wine to be enjoyed. So this is actually a pretty big deal about um, in that day and time and culture to understand what he's doing with these jars. He repurposes what was used for religious purposes and turns it into something that can be used for relational purposes, for socializing. And this will be a theme of his throughout the gospel. And then in the other account that we have, what we see is that Jesus completely changes the meaning of temple from a building structure to himself as the place where one comes close to God. So instead of it being an actual physical building or location, it is being close to him is how one comes close to God. So he redefines what temple is. So this movement of replacing religion with relationship is an undeniable theme that we find throughout the gospel of John and here in John 2. The question for you to discuss or reflect on is what do we learn about people, first of all, from each of these accounts? And then after you discuss that, take a minute to discuss what do we learn about God or what do we learn about Jesus from each of these accounts as well? So go ahead and pause the video and do that now. All right. Well, that's it for today. Hopefully you had an opportunity to also do the pray, go, baptize, and teach. If not, go to our website and find activities and opportunities for you to do that. Share something that someone else said or did during this lesson today that impacted you during this time. This is what we somewhat humorously call our bye-bye blessing. And then once you're done, act with grace and simplify faith and have a great day.